inspired and bold choice because you have created on its site probably the most successful contemporary sculpture in Britain. I think it is. Uh, I mean, I think it's a beautiful object anyway. Mm. So what we have here are the actual original puppets. As far as I know. Mm -hmm. And we can see here they have the articulated legs, mm -hmm. the articulated neck. This is the young Rudolph. Yeah. And here's Santa. When you opened the box mm -hmm. and uh, took these fellas out, mm -hmm. it was like I was seeing old friends. Yeah, exactly. I bought it at auction, got it home, and I noticed it had a lot of sparkle. It was sold to me as a cubic zirconia in silver. The artist is Clementine Hunter. I have had the joy of owning these paintings for between 30 and 40 years. This is a depiction of a nativity scene. It's Mary seated with a baby Jesus with the manger and the three wise men and the angels flying overhead. And found a cardboard box and opened it up and these watches were in there. We really don't know anything about them. I remember just seeing it as it came in and, you know, it seemed to take the take room it. over. So you're dealing with something magnificent here. We tested it, we looked at it, we put it under the loop, we used the diamond tester just to be sure. But in fact, it, it does test as diamond, not as CZ. And the classic Rolex Datejust in stainless steel in the three fourth, the $4,000 range. Wow. She was a very prolific artist. Yes. I would comfortably value it at a million pounds. Amazing. As a group of watches in that little cardboard box that you brought in at retail, you've got somewhere between forty-six to fifty-seven thousand dollars worth of watches there. Oh my goodness! <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. That is amazing. I would say a conservative selling price would be in the twenty-five thousand to thirty thousand dollar price range. Amazing. If they're genuine Clementine Hunter paintings, I would think that each are worth about. $2,000 to $2,500 a piece. So maybe four to $5,000 for the both. And that's in an auction setting. What an amazing, amazing piece. If I were to estimate it at an auction, mm -hmm. I wouldn't estimate it less than eight to 10,000 for the pair. Mm -hmm. What it would go for at auction, that's anyone's guess. Okay. My mom's gonna love that.